It is with a heavy heart that we gather here today to mourn the loss of WWE Wave 2. We've been waiting years for its release to see so many legends join the ranks of their plastic counterparts to recreate incredible matches or create ones we always dreamed of seeing. In those early days of its announcement, there was lots of excitement in the air. The days started looking grim, but we never lost hope. We didn't cancel our pre-orders, and we had faith that release would happen someday. The release of Ultimate Warrior at Gen Con gave us all a glimmer of hope that maybe not all was lost. And I felt that same way when John Cena was announced. But sadly, only a week later, that hope received an attitude adjustment and was down for the count. With the modern age rotation, getting rid of all WWE figures from modern, we can safely assume that this is the one, two, three for wave two. We don't know the full story nor do we truly know if WizKids is legally allowed to say anything. So there's no need to try and point blame onto anyone. Instead, I urge all of you to take a different approach. Instead of being sad, let's be happy about the times that did happen and all the good times we had. So if you could, please join me in a moment of silence.